starting to find it now. Yeah, it feels that way. It feels like he's starting to get comfortable with this roster. You know, maybe him and Attach, it just it didn't work out for them. Maybe with Fame, he's got a little bit more control on what he wants to do. But off about 15 seconds was Minnesota Rocker. But here comes a P2 break for LA Thieves as they just swarm right through open and close is Fame. A five and two start, strong start for him. But the rest of his teammates go down, and there's that SMG duo popping off. Yeah, they have been disgusting, and you see the plays they are three making. Three on three, and they're just going to hunt him down. LA teams are going to hunt Bants down right now, but Octane's going to get taken out. It's a big kill by Bants, and Afro with one on his own. So now they know. We can just kind of slow down. Just watch Bants on the minimap. Right there, just so focused on finding him because he's spawned behind him. Here comes the push. They line up, and Afro just melts him. That's six in a row in a cruise missile for Afro. He ends up getting three in that sequence, and how disgusting it is. Out of Cammy's POV, what is he able to do? They're keeping it. able to find one more, but we talk about P3 so much on this map, and you can see why right there. Just a clean hold from Minnesota Rocker puts them up 28. So far, so good. On Vance's POV, still three in a row to go. One right the opposite side of the doorway. That's going to be a tough fight versus Kitty. He's oh, ready yeah, good for the battle. Yeah, he's shutting them all down. Cammy going to be the last alive now for Rocker. So far, so good for Thieves. They're starting to bring it back. Looking for a lead change of their own, but the shots nice there in the backside for Cammy. Yeah, I mean, Cammy just stays alive and he actually blocks his spawn. Okay. So one player spawns all the way out. Fame is there now right on the hill. So it looked clean. Three dead. Off of Kenny's two-piece, but then right off of spawn, Rocker get into the hill. So keeping around that 20-point lead, you have Kenny with dead silence working that back door, trying to find the flank. He's able to find it. Here comes the rest of the team. But Cammy staying alive. Another cruise missile to work with for Minnesota. Oh, four P2. But you do have one player, Vance, just kind of lurking top dark right now. And Vance is just trying to stay alive, set up that pinch. But Envoy, Octane, able to find multiple kills. Octane, maybe a, you know, a slower start than what we expected from what we've been seeing online. But a big comeback here. P5, what a hold from them. Now into P1, they have the lead. Up to 11 points and spawns for P2. Is Kenny able to drop three? And this is that trap that we talked about, right? This is what we saw at the end of their online match. Can they hand Minnesota Rocker get out of this? Yeah, and, and just in general, like Rocker have played people tough at times and they just not have what it takes to close it out. But the ice hasn't been there in some of these big moments and Kenny is just tearing them apart. That's going to be six in a row now. Just trying to get up in the box. Please, game, let me in. This is a very hard point to break, a uh, hard, hard point to break into, but like it seemed like, I, I don't know, like the comps were a little bit off there. I know there was somebody misspoke about a streak versus a yeah, game, I mean, but the all. timing of it, um, you know, it's hard to break regardless, but it seemed a little bit of a cluster when they were first set it up. Yeah, I liked it though. It's a little bit unique though, right? Just timing that equipment. Necessarily you're in desperation mode. Like getting 19 more points, not like five. So you've got a chance to set up here, maybe get the time and then think about the next rotation. Oh. Not have to do both, but that is a problem. I thought the trophy was going to deal with it. Not going to happen. Oh no, the missile comes through, picks up two, that's four dead, and everything I said about Rocker's chances just got blown up. Yeah, we're always surprised when cruise missiles actually work. So there we go, the two-piece comes in from Kenny. It pays off a couple of more seconds. They take this map, Envoy, just trying to stay alive. Him and Kenny going off on this map, number one. We talked about the form this sub duo was in. Online coming into this major, they are keeping it up here in this map, number one. Well, it's just a matter of time now, unless there's an absolute miracle here for Rocker. That's three headshots through on the feed for LA, and that will do it. Thieves strike first, they get on the board, and what was uh, kind of a gritty early go? Well, Afro tries to tuck into the corner, he's able to stay up. Teammate gets dropped, he at least gets one, but will fall right after. So, on the way into the point. I thought maybe a little bit of a panic there for a moment, but Kenny's got the angle to finish the kill, so it'll be fame by himself. We'll see what this young man is capable of in this moment, trying to pull off the 1v3. Not gonna happen. Octane, talk to win some stuff. Afro hit with an A, taken down to half HP, and that's a follow-up. So two nades going to connect. Nice opener there from Thieves. Afro ripped out of it. I mean, he, he gets what? He gets stunned to start the last round. He catches two frags here. Good luck.
And this is uh, another interesting round. I mean, Envoy by himself plants the bomb. Kenny in Arcade. He's going to get spotted. Well, Bance is going to find that. They know Envoy's in here, so they can isolate him. And then it's Draza and Octane. This is very similar to the way FaZe plays this map, right? They work the A bomb and then on the ARs to kind of clutch this round out. But it can be difficult when you have no map position. But it's I see your leg! And now it's a one versus one. Oh, you hear some. I mean, you and I hear some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, I'm going to assume he does. Oh, he's down. He can quickly bye -bye. help out his teammate. But there you go. There's a first blood up to five and one for draws now. Has a nade. Are you going to peek this? Afro was thinking about it, but he's going to back away. Cami still trying to find an opening. Trying to work that flank. And we've seen this from time to time. You can wrap all the way around to B. The problem is the clock, 25 seconds left. These are gonna know something is up sooner or later with the info that they have. When you put multiple deadies into this, you hope you at least get a kill off of it. There's one, it's fame. Plant going down, that'll be done. Cammy's able to find a pick. I think at the tail end of his daddy or the spot that he was able to get to. Numbers now to rocker as they find the picks. Remember, is Draza with that first blood. Rocker trying to clutch up, and they desperately need a round. Envoy, I think, going to get caught. It's a tough gunfight, and he will fall. Rocker, you win the 3v4 in a round that you, you need. On this map on the year, so there was another one of those examples yeah, with that yeah. first blood. Bomb going down. Bance trying to work the flank, but Draza, the timing goes his way. You saw the frustration. A Bance's face can't be able to clean it up and find that oh, kill. Well, there's another first blood for them, though, right? See if this time they can do it. Daddy still going for Envoy. Nice Shots. snap back. That was beautiful. I thought he was caught, but Envoy, a freak on the sticks. This time, Thieves behind the first blood, they close it out. And right, that might go differently if Envoy loses that gun. No? Wait, what was the, the first? Oh, yeah, first time they hit the stun and got it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's four first bloods for Thieves. And there's another one. Had it. Yep. Octane putting damage to just about everybody. Two are going to drop, three are going to fall. They're getting mowed down like you mowed your lawn this morning, Joe. It's a beautiful day for it, honestly. Nothing like a cup of coffee and mowing the lawn. Oof. A beautiful sunny day, but LA Thieves, as you said, mowing them down. Oh, wow. Well, Cammy again. Adios. The second one. You die fast. Couple of headshots, that's it. Yeah, it's just gone. We got 30 seconds left on the clock. 3v2 for Rocker. Obviously, a crucial round for them and a crucial map. They're going to win every round if they're going to get this done. Wow. I that oh. looked good. Yeah, at least one or two of those. I thought he's got to be just bamboozled. Like, bamboozled. Like, I shot there. It's a reinforced couch. No, I've definitely. Yeah, you can get wall banged through that. I don't know. Just the scope off. He gets out. The pinch comes through. Take out one. Now, three versus three. At least Afro able to find one. That's going to be bombed down, but Ooh. Kenny with the chow, he was ready for it. Able to take one down, but look at the rest of LA Thieves. They're working sort of that outside near the tower, starting to work towards the defensive side. Maybe they're thinking going over towards B. You have Fame looking around, Cammy just trying to find info. That's a problem for Rocker. Do you notice the distinct lack of the YY sound when we swap POVs? Yeah, this <laughs> off of Kenny, yeah. It got so quiet going to Denny and no Kenny. Oh, but well, the timing is perfect in the, the YY Lord Chows to take down Cammy. 2v1 for the map. Got Daddy. Just what is the timing like? Bombing to the planet. Oh, oh that's like, awkward. Yeah, you're shooting at one, and the other one pops on up. Had a that's going to be fame. He is blocking offensive spawn over towards that top street side. So it, as long as LA Thieves don't have that position, it can be difficult to work over towards Zay. They're going to have to flood through Globe, through Bar. But Draza and, what, who is that, Kenny? Just kind of working the, the spawn. Trying to just waste the lives. They have a lot of time to work with. That's going to be their play. But the other side of the map, Afro, he's going to take down two. Point. Working to get in. That'll be Envoy. The pinch coming in from either side. You kind of got players all over the place now for Rocker. I thought for a second, dead. Draza might have the big play, but he gets dropped, and his teammates step it up and get the rest of the kills. Now on to the point you go. It's going to stop at 15.9. Eight lives remaining for Rocker. Nine left now for Thieves. Kenny's just, again, watching that cross, making sure nobody can get to the oh. outside, but he mantles up the timing. Oh. He just holds that. Maybe that's a kill. Here comes the rest of the retake. That's going to be three dead. 
Now quickly out of connector, they get right onto that point, so still 10 seconds to work with. You pause the clock, you almost have the second take, a nice win for Mate, he's up to 10 and five. One player on the pinch, that's gonna be Afro, maybe the hero for Rocker to win this round one, it's looking that way. Time's dwindling, I don't think you're close enough to go. Point man will be Envoy, not gonna get there in time, or is he? Not quite. So you hold on if you're Rocker, and you did I a good chance. Afro's here. gotten kind of close a couple times, but you haven't seen the same success towards the A site that Thieves had, despite not actually, actually capturing it. Is this maybe gonna be the moment? No, big draws. That'll be two through for him. And you've still got Octane set up close to the point as Kenny's finding his picks. Yeah, and every single time, right, you're starting to work that top street, it, it's been Kenny or Draza working over here towards Globe, towards this connector, making sure no one can help out. This sort of rocker off a of spawn. 10 seconds ago, finally someone's on Ante, but that's gonna be three dead. We know what control. It just takes one chance, one, three, or four dead, and that's gonna be a stack here for Minnesota Rock. You have a couple of players. There's one players bit of on progress. Cammy went to spawn kill, but he's gonna get taken down, and with that, should be the round. So what? They'll be down to tick, right? He's got two thieves, yeah. I believe. Yeah, okay. Well, that, that was almost like as much as it seemed like thieves had more success on the offense, like at that was the point. You go for just a pounded type style, like you, you make the play, you're on the point in a second. Yeah, you're talking about hitting it from the front. I don't know, Joe. I yeah, pounded. I don't know what's going on. I don't what Maeve is thinking about. This guy is yeah. in the mood, but here Woo! we go. 40 seconds left. LAD is up one in lives. Have one take done. But they really just they haven't had a stack. That's really been the key here. Minnesota Rocker have been able to hold on to this position. Which corner are you oh in? You checked the wrong one, and this is what you want to see. Dude, again, he has one health. HP, bro. It's like the third fight I've seen. Just a one health to go. Guy's a miracle, a walking miracle. Is he still alive? He's still alive. <laughs> he survives through it all. Eight seconds left in this one. Lots of tags in, can't finish it, but the feed has been all purple. Five in a row for Bance, and they hold on. A moment again where it it's like they really got a shot here. But defense still. We're looking to see how they want to build up this retake. First point there done. They now get two go. kills though, and now it should be the pinch ready to come on through. You got a lot to watch if you're Rocker. Everybody coming off spawn. Here comes the collapse. Rocker getting the kills though. Kidney doesn't get traded. It's Draza up top that finds them all. And then Kenny helps them out. What a little duo that was in that sequence. Yeah, this is what they have to be wary of. When you're gonna push over towards B, you're gonna give them that A spawn top. Are you able to get this one first? Is it possible? Afro, right back to it. Still knows he's contesting here. It's Octane right on the other side. Both teams just sort of waiting for the reinforcements. Octane's gonna chow. He's not even gonna get gun up before the bad shotguns him. And it's another shotgun there from Afro. Envoy's head ripped clean off. Third segment started. Halfway there, can they get it done? One ripped off the point. You still got players here. We're not done yet. That's why, I, I, I don't know, I find this point very entertaining because well, it, it stretches past yes! you. You can contest on both sides. There's more than one or two kills and it's over. Like, it's fame all with of, the triple. Yeah, fame with three. Now he's done it. It is just a foot race. Look at this. Here we go all the way backstage. Goes Draza and Octane. Trophies are out. This is a quick transition for Minnesota Rocker. This would win them the map. Can LAD hold on to B? That's going to be a big three dead. It is going to be tough, though. You've got 14-14 in lives, which is going to be the major player because you've got almost two minutes left on this attack. So depending on the pace of play, I think it would come down to lives. We'll have to wait and see here. Oh, boy, an opener. Nice little movement there with attack sprint and hop, but still will get caught. But it's Kenny, his sub duo. And it's able to shore things up. That was a nice little sequence there, because you were, what, 14-14 in lives, you take a three-player edge. One player did sneak through, though. That's going to be Cammy, number four, off a spawn. I thought they were going to watch that, and he's actually already on the point. But there we go, draws it top. No windows. longer there. No longer there, ready oh, for that next timing. fight. Yeah, again, just trying to hit the prone. Does get taken down, and now Afro through secret stairs, just trying to play his life. I swear, sometimes it feels like you can prone again silly, and sometimes it just feels so slow. I... I miss like mouse and keyboard insta proud, I'll tell you. But they still need two ticks. They only have five lives. Make it four, make it three. Envoy, my God, he's a human highlight. As everybody falls, it is just down to fame and Afro. They had their chance, they had their moment to end the map here, but we're looking like we're going 2 2. Unless Minnesota 
known for miracles, can pull off another. Not happening here. Well, it's been all defense. It, the losers just... and things seem kind of dire. And then you're just praying that Vegas choke. Well, not choke, but they fall into losers and get bounced. Because you, you lose this and if Vegas gets a win round one, you are sweating. Okay, here we go. Three go down. You have one player on it. You at least stop the clock for now. Afro, he's trying to get pushed up towards those spots to find a couple of players off a of spawn. Envoy, he's hoping his, his teammates will get here, but this might be on Envoy. What he's going to find, okay. that's going to be three dead. That's going to be okay. all four. Now maybe a stack for Minnesota. Rocker, this might be the map. Second point of progress done. Rocker should be able to do it. You've got to fly right now. That's going to be two dead for both sides. Why are we peeking? Pick. It's three. There's one there. It's contested. They're getting dropped all over the place. They don't just stack. They try to take the fight. Maybe think it won't finish in time, but what they have is Envoy's just laying no there. Life. A nade's able to hit, and they will close it out. It's chaos at the end of the point, but Rocker. Uh, I mean, it's just that, like, central. They could spawn everywhere, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I mean, he's able to work through the back. I don't know if he spawned there, got a lucky timing, or what, but they're able to pick it up. The AR is Octane that drives a lock in things down. There's going to be bans to the fourth, so. They win the rotation and a nice hold so far for LA Thieves. Let's see how far this streak will go. I don't think very far. Yeah, just with us with X-Ray. Just see the crossfire. That was in that position. It'll end there. Octane just keeps on shooting. Unfortunately, most of his shots connect with that body. It's already dead on the ground. Envoy still here in the point, though. Trying to build up this lead up 15. Yeah, you have Kenny on the opposite side of the map. Just trying to disrupt this rotation. Vance, though, able to take him down. There's only one other player here. That's going to be Kami on the hill. But he might just get overrun. Does he have some powerful snaking abilities? Kami trying to do what he can, but that is going to be three players in for LA Thieves. And Nate is in. Anything to be like those commentators that are like Jason Babin over. Like, I want, I want to do that in the movie. Just be those idiot commentators and something. Oh, well, some fun. already oh, some already consider you that idiot commentator, so it's that's, not a problem. Uh, well, no, I am. Uh, so that's, yeah, that's fair. You're the brains. I'm the, not the brawn. <laughs> Dumb. Thieves now with a 50 point lead with a nice hold there over towards kitchen behind that break. But Rocker trying to do what they can here at P4. And they start to bring this back. Don't want it to get out of hand. Uh, we've seen some insane comebacks here. Thieves knows all too well about them. Didn't get a whole lot of aim assist on that one. No, 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 we did not. <laughs> no, we did not. That's why I like casting with the in-person versus me. I do this all I see you're like kind of shaking around. Like you're, you're like moving with that. Like, yeah. A little windy. Yeah, a little, little, little windy. A little windy. When the aim assist does not hit, yeah, you'd be shooting them circles. Up with the 100 point mark, though. Go Thieves. Bance now. Uh, a little bit of a snapback, but Draza ready and waiting. New hard point popping now. Thieves will be inside and a chance to extend this lead even further. They're going to be up about 40. Can't How much more can they put on this? Yeah, it can't oh, be found in time. Oh, oh, oh stay down, yeah. young man. Just able to stay alive. That is huge. But now a two versus two. Fame off a spot on a five spree. That is going to be all four dead. I thought LATs were able to hold on. That's a big break, though. So this is where that could have been that. Here we go. Afro. Ready to party. He gets one, drops instantly after. Vance through, though, and he is able to take down two. The read, the comms on point now for Rocker. Chance for a lead change. It is getting tight. Great stuff here from Rocker, and in the lead they go. And now with the spawn, you had one player Afro spawn kitchen, so they know it's all about the front push, but they're just not ready for it. One player, I think that was draws it down low. He was just able to finesse and play his life. They were all focused on him, and then through bedroom come come his teammates, and well, well that should be a break there for him. Just dropping pub-like bombs. Trying to take it out there. Up 25 seconds, we head back towards that P1. Draws it with a nice pick to get Bance off the hill time. And again, just making sure they have spawns for P2. That was the focus on the first rotation. The focus here. Tickle, tickle. Again. Bance with three off spawn, All right, and then he's just gonna run forward. My guy is twisted. And that's what I mean. I mean, they just wanted the case there. Gets a little crazy, but they still hold on, at least for now. They'll worry about the upcoming rotation. That's gonna pop in about 10 seconds here. Envoy lying at the corner. 23 HP. 
it's Draza through on the cross that's got his health. Just nade out to back him up. Trophy there for protection. Draza, my man sitting tight in the pocket. Nice shots. I mean, that is just unbelievable reaction from Draza. You know, able to put that trophy down knows it'll soak up that nade and then wins the next gunfight. I mean, based off that play, no one's gotten close to the hill for 15, 20 seconds now. It's as simple as it was, he's able to find one more, but now the rest of his team are ready for the pinch. And that is going to be four dead for Minnesota Rocker. Uh, LaRue still going hard in the paint. Up to one in the series, 40 points away from taking this one. Let's go to a listen with LA Thieves. It's four dead. Four thieves we come out of it, but they were getting hyped. I mean, you talked about kind of Sam's comms and gameplay ability, what he can do. You heard it all there. He was piecing. Well, yeah, I mean, it was great when Draza, he three-pieced him a couple of times, but then after that, Kenny just, or sorry, Cammy came right back and well, was able to break the hill. They had a chance to win it there, but it all started at the beginning of that listing with Draza finding three kills. Fame trying to just, we're going on a ride. Where, where are we going? I don't know, Joe. He was trying to take us on a trip around hotel. Not sure where that missile ended up, but LA Thieves here at Somewhere P4. on a fortress, huh? Not really sure. Matt is done. <laughs> Series done. I am just confused. <laughs> I, I was got car sick. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the live stream. We got Octane joining us from the Los Angeles. Steve, Sam, how you doing, man? You oh, doing all right? Lies, baby. 20 CDL points. Yes, sir, Sam. 20 CDL points. Sam, you guys actually didn't drop a map to Minnesota. I think the map count was like 13-0, and you finally lost one. How does it feel to give up a map to the Minnesota terrible, Rocker? terrible, especially on a Hemi Expo, dude. Oh, it could have ah, been man. like a CeeLo or something, but... What's going on with Expo? You like the map? Do you enjoy yeah. it? Yeah. Um, I think it plays like one of the better control maps that we've had. It's obviously better than Fortress, and anyone that thinks otherwise is fucking brain dead. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's just a, a great addition to the map pool, kind of like Berlin was last year, you know, little LA Thieves juju yeah, yeah, yeah. towards the end of the year. You know yeah, move your mic a little closer, Sam. Uh, you got Seattle or Phase potentially coming up next. I mean, yeah. is there a team that you'd rather play, or do you, or you don't really not care? I don't really care. I think the fans want us to play Phase. Um, Seattle did just recently beat them, so I don't know yeah. if they're going to get their land buff as they normally do uh, with regard to phase, but, I mean, I'm I'm cool with whoever, to be honest. Yeah, for sure. Chris, go ahead. I got actually an uh, interesting question for you. So I've noticed that uh, you've uh, been doing a lot more content recently. I've actually been tuning into your to your live streams, and uh, you've been doing a road <laughs> to bronze to, yeah. uh, to, to top 250 or iridescent, right, solo. Yeah. So with you guys playing Rocker, and we all know how bad that record is. We all know how bad that record is. What's actually more difficult? Soloing from bronze to iridescent or playing the Minnesota Rocker? Because right now, oh, man, that's not It's right. not looking close. What type of question is this? I'm getting baited on the flank. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's crazy. crazy. That's, no, that's crazy. The Minnesota Rocker, bro, they're a CDL caliber team. It requires intricate amounts of teamwork and gun skill to beat them. Wow. I don't care if we're 15 PR answer. and one map. Count. That's great. PR answer. That's great PR answer. answer. It is true, though. They're very talented. Yeah, answer. Answer. Good roster, fair answer, fair answer. Go ahead, man. <laughs> Sam, I think to, to finish things off, I'm going to ask you a little bait question. Obviously, oh, jeez. Another one. A little, a little bait question. This is what we do. We're trying to create some content here. This is my uh, shtick. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway. Um, so, obviously, you guys are going to be off tomorrow. You're going to be back on the weekend. Moving to the next part of winners. Is there a specific team that you would like to play this weekend and why? Um... I'm kind of cool with anyone. I would like to play Optic. I think that uh, they have looked probably in terms of like peak right now, the best team this year so far. Um, in Respawn, they are like looking insane, especially online. Um, and I think that like there's this like weird stigma that like, oh, let's see if they translate it, but they just came off a second as well. So they're maintaining that momentum. Um, and I just want to see how we stack up. Um, obviously, we scrim them on a day-to-day -day basis, but playing in a, a match environment on land is obviously a completely different beast. So um, in terms of just like pure competition, I think I'd like to play Optic. Nice, man. I got actually one more final question for you. Kenny, man, what is this guy eating, He's bro? Like, bro. 
He's, he's like hitting life. form right now. Oh, I feel he's, like it's he's the end definitely of the, end of the year. Kenny Buff, bro. Yeah, that, actually, that's what we were saying. I feel like insane, it always, bro. whenever it hits that like midway pack of the year, bro, he just gets to go. He's yeah. scaling. He's a scaler. Bro. Scaler, I like that. He it's starts. He's a uh, late game champ. Yeah. Late game champ, bro. Like he's like he's, he's Nassus with a thousand stacks. Yeah, sir. How's it feel playing in a venue like this? No, there's no fans here, right? It's a little quiet. A little different. It's. I mean, it's intimate. I. I don't hate it. Obviously, would prefer the fans, but. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't really have an issue with it. I got second last time I was here, so hopefully we can improve that. Cool. That'd be great. Well, Sam, listen, man, I really appreciate you hopping on. Congratulations you on a big this shit out of me. Yo, <laughs> man, that's really good. That's really good. Fuck yourself, <laughs> yourself, bro. Sam, thank you so much for uh, hopping on, man. I appreciate it. Good luck the rest of the way. And, uh, yeah, man, I wish you the best of luck, man. Not leaving. Good luck, man. Sam, you <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't leave either, Sam. Hang out with the boys. The Flank are live. And make sure to check out Zuma and Chris.